Hey, what is going on guys? Drake here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to download GBA for iOS, which is a Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color emulator for your iOS 9.3.2 device and lower. If you guys are going to enjoy the video, don't forget to smash that like button down below, and let's begin with today's tutorial. So this will work on iOS 10 devices, but obviously as the video is being created today, iOS 10 is in beta stage, and um, I don't recommend downloading things while you're in something beta-wise. I don't just I just don't recommend it, but you can, and it might work. Um, but if anything happens to your phone, that's not on me. But this will work on iOS 9.3.2 and lower, so it's actually quite easy. But there is a trick that I cannot show you, but I can explain because my video software, once I do this glitch to download GBA for iOS, well, it stops recording. Therefore, I only can explain it to you. So it's actually quite easy. Just head on over to the link in the description below, and once you reach it, It'll come up with Piger. Go ahead and click install on Piger, and it will come up with a prompt asking if you would like to install GBA for iOS. I've already installed it, so I'm not going to install it again. So, here's the trick. Um, you can't just let it download all the way. Once it, you click that download prompt, go ahead and go to settings, go to general, then go to date and time, and turn off set automatically. Now you can switch this to any date as long as it is in 2014 any month any date as long as it in 2014 now you just want to go back to your home let your iPhone sit there until GBA for iOS is fully downloaded and once it fully downloads it should look like this and you want to click on it and it should say untrusted enterprise developer now normally you would go ahead and improve it um, so you are allowed in but here's the trick another trick you want to go ahead and click settings you want to go all the way to general scroll down all the way till you find profiles and device management and you want to find the one that belongs for, to GBA for iOS now GBA for iOS will be in the bottom so I'm gonna go ahead and try looking for it as I have a couple certificates already as you can see it says trust go ahead and trust it trust it again boom now it should be able to um, be accessed all the way since you set your date back all the way it should work go ahead and click no okay you don't have to click no but I rather not get sent notifications now remember I'm gonna go ahead and go over it one more time once you click install for GBA for iOS go to general go to date and time and switch your date back to anywhere in 2014 if I switch my date back it'll stop recording therefore that's why I can't show you but I can only hope that you can understand the way I explain it I'm sorry if it's a little hard to understand what I'm trying to say but if you guys can help each other in the comments section that would be really appreciative if anybody gets troubles and remember if this does not work for you then please say that it doesn't work because then I'll know that you know it doesn't work anymore and then I can start getting worked on a new method or anything of the such anyways guys if you enjoyed the video don't forget to leave a thumbs up haven't already subscribed this has been Droggy and see you guys